So take a look at this. Shortly after being hit by a pitch, Toronto outfielder Jose Batista, Joey Bats is what they call him. Joey Bats. So he slides into Texas Rangers second baseman Rugnet Odor really, really hard and aggressive. Now, from this angle, all you see is both benches spilling onto the field. Oh, but here's why both benches cleared. Odor didn't care for Batista's slides and responds with a roundhouse to the face. Watch this. Watch this. Here we go. And. and... Oh, yeah, right. You know, we like to get answers here at Good Day, so we want to know more about Odor's boxing skills from his delivery and all that other stuff that goes into being a championship boxer. Joined on the phone by former professional boxer Brandon Flawless Gonzalez, at one point the number one lightweight, high, heavyweight amateur boxer in the world. Woo. Joining us now on the phone, Brandon, how are you, sir? Everything's good. How are you guys? Good, to, good to hear from you. Okay, have you seen the video? Have you seen the punch? I did, I did. Yeah, it was, uh, it was quite impressive, to say the least. Okay, let's analyze it from both sides, right? From mm -hmm. Rugnet Odor's side and from Joy Batista's side. Okay. Right? So, where do you want to start? So, let's start with Odor. Okay. Uh, what, what did you think of his form, Brandon? What did you think of his well, form? First of all, it, it was, uh, he had his hands in position, so he was able to beat Batista to the punch. Yes. So, looking from what you can, the angle that you could see, uh, it looks like he had a good turn in his head to generate power. Oh, and okay. you couldn't ask for a better punch. It looks like he landed right on the button. If I was to give him any critique, uh -huh. it was, uh, I'd like to see him keep his left hand up when he throws that right for defense. Uh -huh. And, uh, you know, a punch like that, you'd like the guy, like what, what we say is uh, we'd like to see the guy looking up at the light, uh, oh, getting okay. knocked out instead of... Uh, just buckled him, but I would like to see, uh, go for the KO on that shot. You know, Brandon, I was wondering about the, the pre-punch push. I find that the two-handed push in the chest kind of throws the opponent off balance a little bit. Does that help at all? Uh, well, I would, I would recommend if you can touch him, I would say uh, to punch him instead of just pushing him. If you can uh -huh. reach out and touch him, it's best to uh, reach, reach out, out with a punch him. instead of a push. Okay. <laughs> okay, now let, let's break down uh, Batista's face here. <laughs> what, <laughs> he took the punch pretty well, I yeah, thought. Yeah, he did. He, yeah, you got to give him credit. It, it looked like uh, he did see it coming, so he was able to break himself. <laughs> but, uh, again, he does. it does look like he's got a good set of whiskers on there. He, did, he didn't uh, get knocked out from the punch. So I am making I was kind of impressive on his end. He's had a good set of whiskers <laughs> on yes. him. He had a good set yes. of whiskers. <laughs> <laughs> would you, uh, it over and over as, a, as a boxer, would you have rather that uh, Odor throw a combination and not just one punch? Well, yeah, we like to throw our uh, punches in bunches, we like to say. Uh, so definitely would like to see him follow up with a left hook and uh, maybe another right hand in there. Okay, I think we've broken this down. I think so, yeah. Thank you, uh, Flawless Gonzalez. We appreciate that. Wait, wait. Uh, Hold on, Brandon. Hold on, buddy. Hold on. Brandon? I'm here. Um, do you mind if we copyright some of these things for Good Day T-shirts <laughs> in the near future? We will yeah, give absolutely. you credit. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, because so I've got four of them. Punches and bunches? Punches, punches and bunches. Punches uh, and bunches. Set of whiskers. Set of whiskers. Yeah, yeah, you can just... Uh, it yeah, you can throw the flawless boxing logo on there. We're down here at oh, yeah. <laughs> You got it. And you said if you can put hands on him, you said what? Uh, it, I love yeah. if you can touch him, punch him. Okay, you got it. <laughs> there you go. Okay. <laughs> and I like when he said, we like for them to look up at the lights. Okay. Look, looking all up at the lights, lights, my great coach Ray Wood used yes. to say. All of the lights, all of the lights. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thanks for joining us, man. Yeah, we appreciate it. I know, I know I woke you up early. Uh, it's all Dreya's fault. He's the trainer, Dreya. Thanks, man. Take thanks, care, coach. guys. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Are you in need of a good night's sleep?